name's Stacey, 27 years old and I've been at this college for six years now. I enrolled on to Gateway to Progression. The social worker at the time thought it'd be a good idea for me to go back to college to try and help with my anxiety. Well, we made like a list of like things that I'm interested in. Decided on that health and social care would be the best option for me. So I applied for the level one course and moved up to level two. Mature Jill Atkins, she was like really, really supportive and she like encouraged me a lot, which helped did help to build my confidence quite a bit and made me reckon, helped me recognise that I can achieve stuff if I put my mind to it. <laughs> well, if I told myself that I would have got as far as today, I wouldn't have believed myself. I'd achieved my level two in English, which is something I'd like never thought I'd do because I've always been really struggled at English. So to get that, that was like quite a big thing for me. <laughs> and I got GCSE maths. Level 2 English and then Level 2 Health and Social Care. And what are you doing now? Level 3 Health and Social Care. And what's just happened in your Level 3 Health and Social Care? I passed my exam. Sometimes I can get a bit distracted. I've got this constant need to move. So I can I can get very like restless if, if I'm not being able to like just fidget and move and then getting myself to concentrate and just start on something can get very difficult sometimes. I find it very difficult with change, like, if, like after like knowing advance otherwise I get very unsettled. I needed like time to mentally prepare myself so I can s slot it into my routine. Some people might see it as a negative but it's also as a positive, like I'm very honest and straightforward. So, like, which makes me quite trustworthy. Well, like, I tend to like spot the things that other people want generally notice, or think of things that like other people likely wouldn't have done. I go out to learning and support very regularly with Kirsty and, and me, and they're like they're really good. They're really supportive. You can have a good chat, and then they're just like, "Come on, get on with work." <laughs> and I go in there, they help me with because I struggle with like planning and and getting like started on my assignments so they'll help me like plan it out so I can actually get started with it and then sometimes they might proofread it just to make sure everything's grammarly correct and they set me up with read write gold which basically it's a tool that helps read things to me because I don't read it myself I don't always understand it so it reads it to me and it, I, I take it in a bit better then. I eventually want to work with people with learning disabilities just so I can be like their role model and like they've got, they can look up to someone and be like, well, you know, if she can do it, then I can do it as well. Thank you. <laughs>